Hi, my name's Hedy and a big cheese round of travel gift card, mytub.co. It is a .co, it is not a .com. This, you're yawning. <sighs> you're yawning, I'm gonna blow on your face. <sighs> is my best friend, Muppet Bundle Cundle. <sighs> Today we're talking about, oh, I knew that was coming. I knew it might be another one as well. Um, they talking today about Google, google.co.uk or google.com. It depends where you are, the IP address. It used to actually be really specific that if you basically went onto google.co.uk and you were over here in the US, then on the top right hand side, you'd have to say, no, I want to change the country or change your location now. It makes absolutely no difference. They're grabbing your IP address regardless. They just now know that you're checking google.co.uk. I'm going to show you a couple of tips. They are no brainers, but if you don't know, you don't know, which is why I'm here to show you the way. No brainer, type in google.co.uk. I'm sorry. It used to have like a whole section down here of what you basically could do, what you couldn't do, uh, of like changing your location, etc. But you just now, very simple, you just go into google.com and you type it out. And again, it doesn't have any location requirements. I'm sorry, I'm trying to pad it out and make it really, really fun. But this is like, you just type in google.co.uk or uh, do google.it for Italy or whichever country, IL for Israel. You, you just type it in and it will grab the IP and it'll be totally fine and it'll say, oh, we know that you're in San Francisco with a dog that is just passing out that needs a Cornetto, but we know that you want to see what's going on in Israel and that's totally fine with us because we're still going to grab the links because every time that you click on a new link and you've typed something else in Google, they're grabbing that data anyway and they're keeping a track of it. You'll see it. It always says like Google to blah, 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 blah and then you go to their website. So say for example, you go over to Jerusalem Post, you, you you click on type in google dot, in google.com you type in jerusalem post and you click on the link and it won't just go to jerusalem post immediately if you look on the top url there'll be a little conversion thing that goes on that's like it looks like it's scrambling they're grabbing your ip details anyway it makes no difference regardless but you don't need any other way apart from typing in dot co dot uk go british or dot com my name's Hedy, and a big cheese found of travel gift card at mytab.co. It's a .co and it's not a .com. She's K-lined and her name's Muppet. <laughs>